Oh my god, it's a brood... Uh, we don't love what we see here on their team. Tiny brood monkey king. It's like a shit game for a mid Rasta, but we will do what we can. Actually, besides from brood, they don't have very good heroes for killing the wards, is one thing. The heroes are actually really bad at killing the, the snakes other than brood, but brood is amazing at it, because the spiders are very fast. Very fast at killing wards. We'll see who they uh, send mid. It's tiny, I guess. What do you want? You gonna steal my rune? No, you're not. Oh, I see. It's a 6 0 already. The classic. Tower is removed nice and early. Sadly, their monkey is level 6. He seems to be having a good time. That's a lot of spooters. We got the Midas. This is important for mid Rasta. If you're gonna play it, you need to be a bit greedy. Rush Midas. So we can actually stay uh, stay relevant. Or the game will get very difficult. We can kill Brute. Fuck, dude. If only he turned for the brood immediately, we could have killed him right there. <sighs> but he got away from us. That is very unfortunate. Monkey King. Ow. Hmm. Hmm. Oh yeah, yeah, we're super dead. Oh, wow. Just the entire enemy team. Well, they have a pretty mobile team. So, um, an unfortunate part about that. Huge. Yeah, I love this ancient camp. It's so easy to stack. We're gonna try and farm it with our uh, our snakes a little bit. Ah oh, shit! Yeah, this death. Yeah, they will team for it as well. Oh, 
I have haste. I'm coming. I'm coming. Hiya! Yeah. Got his ass. Oh shit, monkey as well. Fuck. That's a lot of them top. Well, they TP top with uh, Brood and... I think Tiny and Monkey King. Seems everyone. So Twink is coming up down here. Oh fuck, the Sand King as well. Oh! Okay, I'm dead. I'm dead to the Sand King. Kill me! Neutrals? Nope. Big cats. Oh, dude, when we went, uh, when we went to uh, my friend's place for board games, uh, fuck the toss or the the punch, man. No, oh, the Echo Saber, that's cheating. Alright, power spike. <laughs> Let's uh, go towards top. Can uh, do shit. Oh, I'll go in this and we kill mid, even. Ah, uh, they know. They know. Holy shit, dude. They kill us so fast. Yeah, the BKB brood just says I'm dead. Holy fuck, they burst in my tide fast. I guess the Monkey King ulti. Lot. Yeah. Six Maelstrom procs. And powerlifting has statistically the least injuries than any sport except chess. I mean. I haven't looked at numbers for stuff, but I I can believe that, uh, at least a very fundamental thing, I believe that uh, powerlifting probably has a significantly lower injury rate than, for instance, running, which is literally among the most dangerous things you can do. Which is also funny, because it's one of the things we ought to be able to do, it feels like. Go you fuck! <laughs> no! You fucker! Hunt! Chase! Oh, around the corner of fucking Monkey King too. You piece of shit monkey. Can we get on Monkey? All in, go, 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 Nice team, I love your team, very good team. The Hoodwink, he wants to die too, get him! Oh yeah, just push, easy.
Yeah, I mean, it's pretty true, Sneaky, that, you know, most injuries in running are not terrible, but a lot of the injuries in running are detrimental to the point that you cannot keep performing the exercise, right? The amount of runners who experience at some point in their career or during their, you know, lifetime a debilitating injury that doesn't allow them to keep doing what they love is very high. Like, I've had it myself, and I think... I, I want to say most people who have spent a serious amount of time doing running have gotten to a point that they injured themselves pretty badly within the discipline. Uh, enemy team rushing. Who needs Roche? It's fine. Fuck him. So they have Aegis on Brood. He also has Sanji Asha, so my disables are questionable against him now. We did get Yules and Blink from last fight, so... Or since last fight, so... I'm getting stronger. I am highest level in the game along with the uh, Waspy. Must be higher than me as well. Even. Got monkey boys! <laughs> it's easy. Where are you going? Nowhere. <laughs> Push him around. Yo, let's go, mid Rasta is here. I'm taking this. I need mana. Next up, we have the refresher. Next stop, refresher. Mm, we should get melee with my stuff, right? Uh, they're respawning a lot. Watch out, watch out, watch out! Fuck, I didn't get the hex on the right guy. <laughs> Actually, my wards did fuck over the monkey, though. Chill? Can we back out? It's good, it's good fight. Oh. oh no. Oh yeah, now it's, now it's not a good fight. It was a good fight, yeah. Oh no, he might get caught too. He's not very quick. <laughs> he has Ravage, but yeah, no, 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 ah, oh, shit. Is it worth it? Just run, get out. Let's get people by now. Crack this tower, I can double ulti on next tower. out boys uh, I'm not useful anymore yeah need to attack the last lane now coming for you you are hurt I shadow bleed motherfucker I don't have detection Want to story about playing games you were gonna say? Oh, uh, yes, I was gonna say. Oh. Hold that thought. 
Uh, I was gonna say that yesterday we went playing board games together with my friends, and when doing so, Soxy got to meet with the cats there, and... The funny thing is, Soxy weighs about three and a half kilos or so, and uh, the cats in that household are about six and a half or seven kilos, so she was actually about half the size of the, uh, the cats in the house. Which, uh... Led to her being very, very respectful of them, but it was really funny to watch, watch the little interactions between them. Yeah, some absolute chonkers, uh, big guys. Not really fat cats, just you know, cat cats can be so differently sized. Some are just absolutely enormous overall. These are just large, you know. As the shades direct. Ah! Fuck, I have three seconds CD! Alright, get out, get out. Don't fight without my snakes. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, that's too late. Uh, let's, uh, go top, go top. Roshan, Roshan boys, what's up? How am I still alone here? You guys are taking forever to get here. You have teepees. The fucking entire team has teepee, nobody wants to teepee up here. It's like they don't know you can teepee outpost. And now I'm not sure we can do this or not. Take, 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 take. Oh my god, dude. I wish we would have TP'd. Fucking entire team walking there. Hmm. Nice Roche. It would have been a nice Roche, but we fucking walk across the entire map instead of doing a five second TP on three people. Just, I don't know. Just say we don't do it, then we don't do it, I guess. Uh, should have called it off. Should have called it off. It's okay. We don't have buyback on three people, but I think maybe it's still fine. Glyph can kill off the creep waves a bit. They're just going straight for Megas, or are they pushing? Pushing normally. It's okay, we have double glyph. Uh, when multiple people TP, doesn't the TP last longer? It does. And still way faster than walking across the entire map. Alright? Like, significantly faster. We're talking an increment of one second per TP. That is not relevant <laughs> in the context here. No, not at all. But true. If multiple people TP, then the TP does take longer. Teleporting is still significantly faster than slithering across the field. That's equivalent to saying like, yeah, but if there's a lot of people boarding a plane, it takes a long time to load up the plane, so you might as well just fucking walk to Africa's southern point from, you know, Sweden. <laughs> it's like, well, you're right. But it's just the scale of it is not really... Um, doing justice. Alright, I don't have ulti. Chill. You are do have refresher, but two buybacks. It's time to chill the fuck out. There's also time to get this. You are extremely deep. Oh my god. Alright, that was just unlucky.
They tip it base, brood. We try to catch. Invisal. Bot back. I do have ultis though, we can still do stuff. Look for stuff. When I get high ground vision. Ah, oh, fucker. Ah. Oh. Okay, I'm still dying back here. Can't stop me! <laughs> Woo! Easy wards, easy wards. Uh, would it be really, really good to sell Midas and get BKB? Would actually win the fight? Probably, I don't know. Uh, it can be good to do that. I think I'd rather want travels level two, but yeah, BKB is an item that we could buy. Uh, I don't think they would be significantly as good as you are thinking because they already have. Basher on this guy, they have great insta-stun and kill potential, like BKB and trying to tank is maybe doable if I BKB blink in and shackle someone, but I could still be DPS down uh, even through a BKB by either Monkey King or Broodmother, uh, even the Tiny kind of smacks pretty hard and there's the Basher to cancel it as well, and they could easily buy another Basher on the Monkey King if they so desired. I think Travels level 2 would have been more likely for me as the next item. And then probably I would just replace, uh, I would replace my Arkham Boots with Travels level 2, and then I would replace the uh, Midas, most likely with an Aeon Disc even, uh, as they don't have a Nullfire yet. And yes, they can go for a Nullfire, but even, even so, I think it's still pretty nice for just being able to sneak in. It would prevent one-shots from the Sand King, the Tiny, or any form of Hoodwink setup to try and stop me from ratting, which is basically my main quest in this game, is to deal building damage. As you can see, I did 16,000 building damage, pretty much the significant part of our building damage comes from me and when I have Refresher and their throne is exposed like this, I think uh, being able to reach the enemy throne is the most important thing. Uh, you could say that B BKB works towards the same thing. Um, I would say kind of, because again, insta-stun chain disables are very strong on their team. So if I get spotted and then go on me, then I can't do what I want, but if I have Aeon Disc, then they can't chain stun me, I'll get the Wind Waker out somehow, I'll maybe blink away, you know, like, things can happen. Um, so yes, that's the reasoning for why I would want to do that.